All right, I'm back. Thank you, uh, thank you three for holding out for so long. Uh, finally made a decision. Um, I refuse. I won't go. Hal thinks he'll use the chaos to advance himself. Make him wrong, Bob. See that justice is done. Our family always does our duty first. The Darkspawn must be defeated. You must go. For your own sake and for Ferelden's. Well, I just spent an entire week trying to... No, wait. I think it was only a couple of days. Okay, I spent a couple of days thinking about this. Thinking about saying no. A well, few minutes is all I need to say yes. Let's go! Leave quickly then. Bryce, are you sure? Our son will not die of Hal's treachery. He will live and make his mark on the world. By banging Harry, every chick and getting her pregnant. That's how I'll do it. That's the best way I can think of. Eleanor. Hush, Honestly, I'm like a horny teenager, so what other best plan do I have? That door to buy them time. But I won't abandon you. Mom, you're so badass. I'm so proud of you. I love you both so much. Then live, darling. Become a Grey Warden and do what is right. I will, Mother. I'm... So sorry it's come to this, my love. We had a good life and did all we could. It's up to our children now. Then go, pup. Warn your brother. I know that we love you both. You do us proud. They've broken through the gates. We must go now. Goodbye, darling. My parents were killed by a trusted friend. Oh my god. I just lived through Disney's Lion King. Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> this is so child friendly. We will be traveling south through the hinterlands to the ruin of Ostagar. It's fitting we make our stand here, even if we face a different foe within that forest. The king's forces have clashed with the darkspawn several times, but here is where the bulk of the horde will show itself. There are only a few Grey Wardens within Ferelden at the moment, but all of us are here. This blight must be stopped, here and now. If it spreads to the north, Ferelden will fall. Ho there, Duncan. King Caelan. I didn't expect a... A royal welcome? I was beginning to worry you'd miss all the fun. Not if I could help it, Your Majesty. Then I'll have the mighty Duncan at my side in battle after all. Glorious. The other wardens told me you'd found a promising recruit. I take it this is he? Allow me to introduce you, Your Majesty. No need, Duncan. You are Bryce's youngest, are you not? I don't think we've ever actually met. Hello to you too there, pretty boy. Yes, Your Majesty. My name is Tony. Your brother has already arrived with High Ever's men. But we are still awaiting your father. He's not coming. He died when our castle was taken. Dead? What do you mean? Duncan, do you know anything about this? Terran Kuzland and his wife are dead, Your Majesty. Arl Howe has shown himself a traitor and overtaken High Ever Castle. Had we not escaped, he would have killed us and told you any story he wished. I can scarcely believe it. Well, how could he think he could get away with such treachery? He's a smug I bastard. Here. I will turn my army north and bring Howe to justice. You have my word. Thank you, Your Majesty. That's all I can ask of you. No doubt you wish to see your brother. Unfortunately, he and his men are scouting in the wilds. Of course he is. But I'm not eager to tell him, Your Majesty. Of that, I have no doubt. You will see him again once the battle is over, I am certain. I apologize, Hopefully. but there's nothing more I can do. All I can suggest is that you vent your grief against the Darkspawn for the time being. 
So long as Earl Howe pays, I'm happy. I'm sorry to cut this short, but I should return to my tent. Logan waits eagerly to bore me with his strategies. Your uncle sends his greetings and reminds you that Red Cliff forces could be here in less than a week. Ha! <laughs> Eamon just wants in on the glory. We've won three battles against these monsters, and tomorrow should be no different. <laughs> you sound very confident of yourself. Overconfident, some would say. Right, Duncan? <laughs> hey, confidence is a good thing. Your Majesty, I'm not certain the blight can be ended quite as quickly as you might wish. I'm not even sure this is a true blight. There are plenty of darkspawn on the field, but alas, we've seen no sign of an archdemon. Disappointed, Your Majesty? I'd hoped for a war like in the tales. A king riding with the fabled Grey Wardens against a tainted god. But I suppose this will have to do. I must go before Loghain sends out a search party. Farewell, Grey Wardens. Farewell, Your Majesty. What the king said is true. They've won several battles against the Darkspawn here. Yet you don't sound very reassured. Despite the victory so far, the Darkspawn horde grows larger with each passing day. By now, they look to outnumber us. I know there is an archdemon behind this, but I cannot ask the king to act so Don't long. worry, I'll take all the 500 on the right. You take the other 500 on the left. Huh, why doesn't he listen to you? He seems to re regard the Grey Wardens very highly. Yet not enough to wait for reinforcements from the Grey Wardens of Orlais. He believes our legend alone makes him invulnerable. Our oh, fantasies will do that to few. young children. We must do what we can and look to Terran Loghain to make up the difference. To that end, we should proceed with the joining ritual without delay. I need to eat first. Need some food in my belly. <laughs> I agree. Hey, some beans. We have until nightfall to begin the ritual. And meat. Every recruit must go through a secret ritual we call the joining in order to become a Grey Warden. The ritual is brief, but some preparation is required. We must begin soon. Wonderful. Let's get it over with now. Feel free to explore the camp here as you wish. All I ask is that you do not leave it for the time being. There Aww. is another Grey Warden in the camp by the name of Alistair. When you're ready, seek him out and tell him it's time to summon the other recruits. Your hound can stay with me while I attend to some business. <coughs> the Grey Warden tent is on the other side of this bridge. You will find us there should you need to. Alright, Maxicus. Max, go with Duncan. He'll feed you some good food. While well, I look for it myself. Here, food, 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 food. Here, food, 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 food. Just gonna look for some chests and sparkly thingies. Because I know that I need all the stuff I can get. So I can sell it. Make some money. Nothing here. What's this? Aha! Elf fruit. Elf fruit. Naturally. Who names these things? Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm what do we have here? Sacks. Ooh, a do a gift for my dog. Let's see. I think that's all I can collect here. Yeah, that looks about right. All right. Let's go. Oh, more elf fruit. I don't even need to the elf fruit. Just need to sell it. I am Spartacus. Nice kilt. What's underneath there? I see a white little dot. Is that your wee wee? I think that's your wee wee. 
ยอยดิงดองเฮ้ยคุณเป็นผู้ชายเกรย์วอร์นที่ถูกไปแล้วใช่ไหมนั่นใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่ใช่I was hoping for a comely lass with golden hair and terrible eyesight. Ah, <laughs> uh, don't we all? The name's Davith. <laughs> It's about bloody time you came along. I was beginning to think they cooked this ritual up just for our benefit. Yeah, maybe they did. Just to give us a good scare? No, they don't really seem the type. I happened to be sneaking around camp last night, see, and I heard a couple of Grey Wardens talking. So I listen in for a bit. I'm thinking they plan to send us into the wilds. Maybe. Oh, whoa, whoa! Sorry, got a little burp there. Maybe they will. We'll see. It's all too secretive for me. Makes my nose twitch. I guess we'll have to wait and see. <laughs> like we have a choice. Hey, I'll watch your back if you watch mine. I suppose I could do that. Anyway, I expect it's time to get back to Duncan. That's where I'll be if you need me for anything. See you later, man. Take care of yourself, and try not to get struck out again. And I think the last recruit. In the name of I bless you today. May you find this guy. favor in the Maker's eyes. Greetings. So you must be the third recruit we've heard about. I am. And who are you? Sir Jury is my name. I hail from Redcliffe, where I served as knight under the command of Arl Aemon. Well, it's good, sir. Knight. A man who knows how to fight. If I may ask, were you a soldier before you came here? I was not a soldier, but my father did train me to fight. Are you a nobleman? I am honored to be in your company, my lord. I hope we're both lucky enough to eventually join the wardens. Is it not thrilling to be given that chance? Hmm. I'm curious about the joining ritual. As you know I. anything about it? Has anyone told you about it? Dev said we might be going to the wilds. I never heard of such a ritual. I had no idea there were more tests after getting recruited. I suppose since you're finally here, I'd best get back to Duncan. I shall see you there. All right, bye, Jory. Aha, more stuff for me to take. I'm glad no one's stopping me, taking all these supplies just for myself. Oh, and then there's this prisoner guy. We're all going to die. Huh? Someone finally comes and talks to the lone prisoner. I don't suppose you've come to sentence me. You haven't been sentenced? That's just wrong. No, they put someone like me in a cage until someone important has time to decide what to do with me. I don't suppose you have a bit of kindness in you. All I want is food and water. They haven't fed me since I was locked up, and I'm starving. Hmm. Why would I want to help you? What will I get out of you, Mr. Naked Man? Because you might want something I don't need. Them Circle Wizards got a chest they keep things in, magical things, and I stole the key. That's why I'm here. I got one of them drunk, took his key, and tried to sneak to the chest. They assumed I was deserting. I can't use it from here, but I'd trade you for some food and water. 
and they didn't find the key when you were arrested? I swallowed it. But it's uh, come back into my possession since then. So oh. Oh, God. That's disgusting. Yeah, well, do you want the key or not? Oh. Uh, is there any way to wash it before you hand it over to me? I don't know, spit shine or something. Anything's better than... Oh, God. Uh, I'll see what I can do. Just ask my guard for his. Ugh. He's still got some dinner. I saw him put it in his coat. All right, all right. Oh, God. I lost my appetite. I don't need no more Lucky beans. Dog. You great wardens get to ride with the king while I'm left with the drudgery of guarding this deserter. They should have just hanged him. Put his head on a pike as an example. Ah, uh, calm down there, buddy. Uh, I had a chat with him, actually. Don't expect it was an enlightening conversation. He asked for, for some food and water. Did he now? Since nobody sends me nothing to feed him with, the only way we'll get that is if I give him mine. So you miss one meal. This man could be hanged soon. Come on. All right, all right. I guess the poor fella could stand to have one meal in his belly before he hangs. Don't know why you care. I had nothing to do with it, though. If anyone asks why he's burping, I'm going to say it was you. Just so you know. Eh, yeah, that's fine. I'm too important for anyone to get mad at. All right, buddy. So? Brought me some food, have you? I'm so hungry I could faint dead away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's the food. Much obliged. May Andraste herself rain blessings upon you. And, as I mentioned, here's the key. Use it in good health, huh? Oh, God. It's dripping. Oh. This is nasty. And I'm guessing I can't use it now. That guy's right there to the chest. So I gotta find some other time to do it. I mean, meanwhile, what's this guy doing? Access. Oh, wait. This guy can sell stuff, too. Uh, first, let me see if I can collect all the stuff. So I can sell it. Oh, you look important. Excuse me, I must get the hounds ready for battle. Half the dogs are sick from dark spawn blood. Okay. You there, elf. What's your name? Ah, uh, it, it, it's Pick, sir. Go tell Turn Logan that the war party's ready to begin scouting. We'll send word if we find anything amiss. Yes, sir. R right away, sir. Wait a minute. Get back here. Hello? I I'm sorry, is there something you needed? What do you mean? I deliver messages around the camp. You have a message for me? Yes, I do. Then what is... Oh, wait. Are you the one I'm supposed to give Sir Garland's sword to? Because I think the smith's done with it. Um, yeah. Yeah, give me the sword. That that's about right. Oh, that's such a relief. You really saved me from the switch for sure. I'd best get back to my duties again before I get in more trouble. <laughs> I'm an evil bastard. Ah, 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 ah. It's all mine. I don't even know what the sword looks like, but it's all mine. I'm probably going to sell it, but it's all mine. And I th think that's all I can take. Ah, I'm a horrible person, but oh well. We're all gonna do what it takes to survive in this war-torn world. Sorry, sir. What was it? Garland? I think it was Garland. Look carefully, man. This wretched. Oh, yeah. They're strong and cunning and smart, but don't listen to those old white tales. They can be killed. Uh huh. Let's take that. And I think we're all good. Yep, I think that's everything. Now I'll sell all this junk. And then I'll be the richest man in this camp. Besides the king. And the nobles. And I'm pretty sure everyone else. Actually very poor for a nobleman. It's kind of sad and strange. 